good afternoon Melissa here welcome back to my channel it is 10 past 4 I'm on my way home from work this is wrapping up my second to last day so tomorrow March 1st is my last day on the job so as you've probably guessed by my by the title of my video I am seriously considering and probably going to make a move out to Arizona I have a very important job interview tomorrow online that I'm hoping I will knock out of the park and if I do um, I will be moving out to Phoenix and the job is with the federal government so I'll be moving out there um, <coughs> excuse me um, so a little backstory here I was born in Portland, Maine and lived there until I was mm, about six years old. My family moved us to New Hampshire where I've been ever since. I've never lived anywhere else but New Hampshire. And the only thing that's keeping me here is my dad who just turned 80. Granted, he's in pretty good health for 80, but um, I just, I feel bad about leaving him. I feel guilty, and he told me not to, and that I need to do what I what I need to do, and I know he's right, and I don't want to get too far into that because I will get emotional, and I'm sorry about the bumpy camera, but roads around here really suck. So, why Arizona? Arizona because my brother and my mom live out there in Phoenix and they have graciously offered me a place to live out there. this November. I'm really sick of winter. I don't enjoy winter at all. And I figure if I'm going to make a drastic move like this, then being out of work is the time to do it. So... That's what I'm dealing with, and I'm just kind of struggling with it because of my dad. I tried to get him to go with me, but he won't. So I did tell him, though, that once he's not able to live alone any longer, that I am coming back to get him and bring him wherever I am, whether it's Phoenix or wherever. But in all likelihood it will be Phoenix. Um, so yeah, that's that's what's going on. Um, I have a storage unit that I'm in the process of working on. I've been selling a lot of stuff on <coughs> Excuse me. I've been selling a lot of stuff on Facebook Marketplace. Um, just trying to get rid of as much as possible. Lighten the load as much as possible. And I'm doing a pretty good job. But now that I'm going to be out of work for a while, I will have more time to do the work that I need to do at the storage unit. 
because lately, you know, I get out of work at 4 o'clock and it's dark by 6. So it doesn't give me a whole lot of time. Actually, it's kind of dark by 5.30, but anyway, 5.30, 6 o'clock. Um, so I will be able to go to the storage unit during the day where I'll have plenty of daylight. The weather's supposed to start warming up. Will be good, and I'll be able to open up all my boxes, go through them, repack stuff into nice new boxes with um, foam sleeves for breakable things and um, labels for everything. And fragile labels for stuff and the whole nine yards I'll be able to really get organized and feel good about that at least and I have to stick around until April at least which I would anyway I have an appointment to sit for my New Hampshire social worker licensure exam, which I am praying so hard that I pass. I really need to pass this because it'll help transfer to another state a lot easier. And I really need that. I really need something to go a little bit smoothly. So, I will be around until sometime in April. Um, maybe longer, depending on what's going on. And that's really it. everything going on in a nutshell. I've got a lot of major life decisions going on. A lot of things to think about and plan for and do and it's <laughs> it's exciting and it's terrifying at the same time. I'm sure many of you understand that feeling. So that's all I have for now. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Consider subscribing if you haven't already. And if you have any tips for moving long distance, long, long distance, with a cat, please drop them in the comments below. I need to, I need to try to make any kind of move I make easier for my cat, Sheldon. Um, that's really important to me. I know he's not gonna like doing a big move at all. So anyway, that's all for now. See you in the next one.